But for our audience who are unfamiliar with hollow anatomy, could you give a quick overview of what it is and what it does for us, Mark? Yeah, just very, very simply. Um, imagine instead of using a more traditional method of learning human anatomy using cadaveric dissection, uh, which is what you see in most medical schools, uh, instead we're using sort of a digital equivalent. So if all you want to do is learn the basics of human anatomy or even neuroanatomy, all you have to do is use holographic display. We currently use HoloLens, but you can imagine any mixed reality you know, uh, HMD or head mounted display to do the same thing where we can look at cross sections of any part of the human body. Wow. So it can, uh, so it can really take any part of the human body, not just a, a full head to toe, but you can zoom in on different parts. And I did read something, obviously you're doing this with Case Western and now you've actually been doing it with multiple institutions. Are you seeing that having those types of abilities and these 3D representations of the human body are they becoming a deciding factor for students when they're deciding where they're going to go to take these types of college education courses? Yeah, we're actually presently in about 25 different institutions. So still wow. very much rolling across the U.S. and around the globe um, in sort of changing forever the way human anatomy is taught and learned. 